Welcome, losers! You already know how this works. Go to the voting booth, write the name of the person you want to vote out, and drop it in the ballot box. Let's go. Lou, it genuinely frightens me that you handle kids. If I had a kid, I wouldn't let him anywhere near you. I'm voting for your A. Sorry, hon, but I have to support Lil this time. You've cast your votes, and now I'll make your decision final. The person with the most votes must leave the camp. First vote, Lil. VRA. VRA. That's two votes VRA. One vote Lil. Nick. Nick. That's two votes Nick. Two votes VRA. One vote Lil. One vote left. The person kicked out of this venture camp is... Nick! What? How did this happen? I'm just as surprised as you. Why did you vote me out? Because you're one of the worst in the challenges. Also, I can't stand you. Who cares about challenges when you've got the babysitter of the year over here? Well, at least she contributes to the team. Oh, piss off. I don't need any of you or this dumb camp anyways. Great final words, Nick. Now, Pip Pip, cheerio, good sir. Welcome to your first elimination. This is how it works. One by one, you must go to the voting booth, write the name of the person you want gone, and deposit it in the ballot box. Sound good? Alec. I'm sorry, but I can't vote for Will or Fiore. I vote for Fiore. Maybe Will exaggerates, but I have to support him. All this drama in the team was just what I needed to save myself. I vote for Will. You have all cast your votes and made your final decision. The person with the most votes must leave the camp. But first, if someone has an immunity totem, you will need to present it before reading them in any elimination, and that will override any votes against you. First vote. Alec. Fiore. Fiore. That's two votes Fiore. One vote Alec. Will. 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 The last vote and first person voted out of this venture camp is... Will. I'm sorry you had those hallucinations. You need some help, man. Will, bust the losers is that a way, bro. It's over. I lost everything. I fail again. I'm sorry for talking to you like that. I was under a lot of pressure. And you didn't deserve that. I saw what Rosa did for you. If she could give a hand to someone who hurt her, I can do the same. Why would you? Do you know the things I've done? How I have hurt others? I know, but I also understand how you feel. The frustration, the despair. The feeling of being stuck in a hole that only gets deeper. I felt that way a while ago. And how did you get out of that? I didn't do it alone. Someone helped me out. <laughs> Welcome to Elimination. As you know, tonight's gonna go a little different. Go ahead, Gabby. Surprise! How the tables have turned! Remember! 
remember when you vote me out at the first day? Gabby has a red marker. She will write the name of one of you, and when I read the name of that one unlucky contestant, that person is immediately out. <laughs> Great. You can all go to the voting booth, write the name of the person you want out, and drop it in the ballot box. Move! Fiore, I'm voting for you. I should have realized it long before. Lil, I'm voting for you so you can crawl back to whatever Disney movie your wrinkled witch face came from. You cast your votes. Now I'll make your decision final. The person with the most votes must leave this venture camp. First vote, Lil. Fiore. Lil. Fiore. That's two votes Fiore, two votes Lil. Fourth person voted out of this venture camp is... Lil. What? But that's not all. We still have Gabby's vote. Fifth person voted out of this venture camp is Ashley. <laughs> Goodbye, suckers! Ellie, why did you do that? I'm sorry, Lil. We were getting down to the wire, and Fiore could be helpful if we reached the merge. What in tarnation? Not to throw a hissy fit, but this is so unfair! Not really. Look at your odds. There's three of us and only two of you. Even a six-year-old can do better math than you. Ashley, Lil, I wish I could lie and say I'll miss you, but I won't. So, time to skedaddle. Y'all will regret this decision. I did my best to convince Ellie not to vote Fiore. I really like that girl. Okay, Fiore tricked us. But if she managed to do that with us, she can do the same with the other team. And that can work in my favor. I was a little nervous when Ashley and Lil exposed me. Luckily, Ellie and Alec didn't fall for their desperate attempt to throw me under the bus. The three of us are going to dominate this game. Welcome, campers, to the last elimination ceremony of this season. A dramatic day for the final four standing. Everyone has voted and made their decision. But first, if someone has an immunity totem and wants to use it, this is the last time to do so. Hmm. If you think you can get rid of me that easily, you're suddenly mistaken. I have the totem, and I want to use it tonight. What?! Oh crap. Wait, isn't that the totem Rosa lost? You were the one who stole it! Too late, Sherlock. I can confirm that this is an immunity totem. Any vote against Rhea will not count. I'll read the votes. First vote? Rhea? It doesn't count. Rhea? It doesn't count. Rhea? It doesn't count. There is only one boat left. The camper leaving this venture camp is... Hunter. This time, a single vote was enough. You're out of the game. No! So close to the end, I could have won that final challenge. I know, that's why you're out. Marcus hasn't arrived yet to take you on the bus. You can stay in the production tent tonight. 
Hunter is finally out. James and Aiden are a heartbroken ball of unstable emotions. The perfect choice to take to the end. At this point, I don't care about anyone. I hope I win that million dollars and never see these people's faces ever again. I'm happy to stay in the game. This will give me at least one more day to try and fix things up with Aiden. Good night, campers. Everyone went to the confessional and deposited their votes in this ballot box. The camper with the most votes will have to leave the camp, get on the bus of losers, and leave this venture camp. First vote, James. Tess. Ali. James. Tess. James. Tess. That's three votes James, three votes Tess, one vote Ally. The last vote goes to... It's time for you to go. What? No, wait! Crystal, can I take Tess' place? If you do, you'll both leave the camp. Guys, guys, it's okay. Don't worry. Can you walk me out? I knew that if you left, attention would fall on us. We must have thought of a plan or something. I don't understand why you're so upset. This is not the end. Listen, you have to move on, get as far as you can. At the end of all this, we will meet again, and we will be together. Yes, that's true. Welcome to Elimination. Another day, another loser. Now get voting. Sorry, Gabby. You're the only one I wouldn't mind voting for. I vote for Ellie. We have to keep this team together. You have all cast your votes. Time for me to read them and make your decision final. The person with the most votes must leave the camp. What's up? I have an immunity totem and I want to use it. I want to use this totem to nullify the votes against Ellie. <gasps> what? Are you sure? Yes, I am. I can confirm that this is a valid immunity totem and it has been used on Ellie. Any votes on Ellie will not count. First vote, Ellie doesn't count. Ellie doesn't count either. Ellie doesn't count. No valid vote so far. Next vote. Gabby. Dan. One vote Dan, one vote Gabby, and only one vote left. The sixth person voted from this venture camp. Dan. Why would you waste your totem on Ellie? I didn't waste it! I saved her because she treats me like a person! Gabby, thank you so much for saving me. No problem, bestie.
Dan, it's time for you to go. Well, good luck, guys. I'm warning you, no more crazy stuff or I will punish you severely. Well, Morans, I hope you have spent the day with the torturous intrigue of knowing who will be going home. Everyone has already voted, but first, if someone has an immunity totem and wants to play it, now is the time to do it. Well, no one. So let's read the votes. First vote. James. Rhea. Wait. James. Wait. James. Late. That's three votes late. Three votes James. And one vote Rhea. The camper leaving this venture camp is... Lake. It's four votes. You must go. Lake! It can't be! I should have known. So sad you have to go, Lake. Baldi, you must go. The bus awaits for you. I'm sorry, Lay. I should have used the totem to save you when it was time. It's okay, Rosa. You've already done more for me than you can imagine. I mean, just look at me. When I came to this place, I was a good girl who had no control over her own decisions. Now I am free, thanks to you. I love you, Rosa. Oh, I love you too. What are you waiting for, Ria? Come here! Well, everyone went to the voting booth and put their votes in this box. The camper with the most votes will have to leave the camp get on the loser's bus and will not be able to return... Uh, what? What happened to you? Oh, it must be the mushroom he ate in the woods. Did you eat a mushroom from the forest? That is very dangerous. Many of those are poisonous. James! What did you do? You were supposed to give the mushroom to Aiden, not me, you idiot! I have no idea what he's talking about. He must be hallucinating. Now that he mentions it, the cameras caught you holding a mushroom when they were looking for the totem. Huh? Call an ambulance, Oliver! Joel is out of the game anyway. He had three boats. A three? So, Yule was planning to poison me, but you decided to poison him. Make no mistake, I only did to get rid of you. I understand. Thanks, I guess. Poisoning someone is too much, unless that someone is you. Everyone went to the booth and deposited their votes in this urn. Camper with the most votes will have to leave camp, get on the loser's bus, and will never be able to return. If someone has a totem... Me! I have an immunity totem and I want to use it now. Fine, bring it. Yes, it's right here? What? 
And give me a second. I uh, I swear I had it in my pocket. What's up? Did someone steal it from you? You don't have the totem. Stop wasting my time. First boat, Rosa. Second boat, James. Third boat, Rosa. Fourth boat, James. That's two boats Rosa, two boats James. The last boat goes to... Rosa, it's time for you to go. I just want to say that I'm living with a clear conscience. I'll play fair, I did the right thing, helped everyone I could, and didn't sell anything. I know who I am, I am not a thief. Yes, yes, very nice. Now go away. Come on, Rosa, I'll walk you out. Thank you for coming with me, Ria. It's the last I can do. I don't know what happened, but you have to be careful of James. Don't worry, I have a plan to deal with James. Ria, I didn't steal anything. I know, Rosa. It was me. What? But how? I stole James' phone and put it in your backpack, along with my perfume. I also took your immunity totem. You... you did all that? Did you frame me? Did you make me look like a thief in front of everyone? I was acting, Rosa. The boys didn't doubt it for a second. Ria, why did you do this to me? We can betray each other inside the game and still be friends outside of it. Just like you betraying the Alliance by spoiling the plan to hunt her. These are things that happen in this game. The problem isn't the game, it is you, Ria. You let the competition change you. You may win the million, but you will be alone again. Come on, Rosa. Don't be mad. <laughs> I am not mad. I am disappointed. 